Ah. <laughs> We're asking Gumshoe to break into the chief's office. Yes, it's called getting sacked. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, Gumshoe, if you did get fired, you'd probably earn more money. <clears throat> yeah, so we can't, we can't, we couldn't be smart and use their government's ID. Slippery fuckers. Right, so mm. we have to. If we're gonna try and get into the uh, in the chief's office, we need Blue to find Badger, some. Blue tell him that he's going to kill him. <laughs> I mean, possibly. Okay, so single stab wound, piercing heart slash lung. I stabbed you the back. Yes. That ends up in the heart and lung. That has to be quite the weapon. It it again. It was a well. That's that's what they, they said in the uh, in the uh, autopsy report. It was a fairly long blade. Oh, we found him. This. Oh yeah, the uh, ID trace. Executive yeah. officer number. Yeah, he, 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 he doesn't seem to click it. So yes, we're trying to we're trying to get him to get him on our side here. Oh, come on, mm -hmm. let us in. Do your job. Come on, be your friend. friend. Yeah, come on, Gumshoe. You can be part of our office. You can you can be the tea lady. I mean, who would do that? Like, <laughs> definitely not us. Won't he do it to save Edgy? Edgy boy. Like, Gumshoe is his, is his kind of his only friend in this play, in this uh, world, it seems. So, I mean, yeah, it's possible. He's seen it before somewhere. Here's the thing, Bart Bratz, we've also seen it before somewhere. Yes. We do. It makes him feel uneasy because it looks like a spinning top. <laughs> he, he, he was raised um, he was raised Jewish and he just had an irrational fear of dreidels. <laughs> so yeah, so I was trying to be clever there, but um Yes, we have seen that jar before. Oh. Mhm. Mm okay. So yes, Again. now we we now need to we now need to get um get Gumshoe on side here. We need to try and find a a way to to help him out here. And yes, Lana is still not budging, not helping us at all. It's almost as if she's completely unhelpful and wants to be sent down for murder. Like, you never know, like, her fancy office might be all night and whatnot, but, like, she might just be happier being around people in a prison. <laughs> yes. All those yeah. people she helped convict. I was about to say, like, um, yeah, no, I decided, like, at the tender age of 31, I was going to take a vow of poverty. And, uh, <laughs> but no better way to do it than get sentenced to, sentenced to death. He's writing something, eh? There he is. Look at him. He's happy as there ever. There he is. So happy to see us. Oh. The table on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> Not every day we get a, you know, a, an actual like mob to kick us out.
That's Edward for you, miserable bastard. Unlike some people, I don't have all day. No. Pick up that paper. Oh, we're doing it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> How is this gonna go now? It didn't work. Oh, shit! Yeah. He's packing it in. Edward's, Edward's saying, peace out, motherfuckers, I'm done. So like, like, again, in a sense, I don't blame him because not a couple of months ago, he was accused of murder and nearly got sent down for it. So, he's had a bit of a rough time. Yeah, As like, in fairness, no, who would want him to be in a court with all of those allegations flying around? Exactly. That's the thing. Letter of resignation, eh? Oh, gotta show to Gumshoe, and Gumshoe's gonna be like, I've gotta save Milesy boy! <laughs> I would love it if his nickname is Milesy Boy, but no, I don't think it is. <laughs> the, only, the only nickname he accepts is Edgy Poo, and that's from Old Bike. So, Edward's also lamenting his, uh, his past, his mistakes. Oh, did he have? That's why I make it my solemn duty to backhand any detectives who get it wrong, especially Gumshoe. He has to learn. Gonna start crying. <laughs> I get the feeling Edward's like tear ducts were surgically removed, so he do, so he can't he couldn't physically cry. Yeah, it's almost like we're old friends and rivals, Edwards. Funny enough. Who's next in charge as uh, the next prosecutor, then? That's a great thing. <laughs> Definitely not Meekins. Like, again, bear in mind, we've only seen two prosecutors, like, in this game so far, if you're excluding Lana Sky. It would be Edwards and Winston Payne. And, uh... I'm gonna go in a limb here and say it's not gonna be him that's gonna get promoted. Like, no, no, mm. no chance in hell. But obviously, yeah, uh, like Edward is the only prosecutor in the series. Like he, he does um, tag in and out whenever necessary. But um, but yes, even for the second game, he is not the main prosecutor. So oh, really? he does get re he does get replaced. He, he gets a wee bit of a break, so... He does. He does. He actually follows through with his, um... Because, again, like, this this fits in timeline-wise between the first and the second game. So when you play the second game and you hear what, like, Phoenix is talking about when relate, when involving Edgeworths, it, it's a bit... It's a bit very, very, very vague, but it's quite... It's, it's, it's grand here because they can fill in the blanks here with this case, you know? Yeah. Okay, so he's pretty okay. Mm. Yes, there's the uh, prosecutor's trophy. Again, something else we've seen before. Yes, it's called working, Phoenix. You should try it sometime. Right. Oh, 
Okay. Oh, was this the the piece of evidence that Gant wanted to give him? Get out of the screwdriver. Ooh. Yeah. So this was the you remember earlier on the case then um the reason Edward's uh, ID was tagged at the crime scene was because he says that Gant basically asked to come to come here. Yeah. So that's that's what's going on here. Which in of itself is quite unusual. Yeah, it is very, very strange. Yeah. And very fishy. Very fishy. So, okay, let's read the letter place. itself. As you can see, it's written in scribble. Mm, I like writing my resignation letters on crayon too. Mm. With crayon too. I mean, it, it does have that extra little, extra bit of emotional punch, doesn't it? Yeah, I, I, that's, you know, that was what I was going for. Yeah, fair point. <laughs> Phoenix, ever very much proven there that the world is a shit place. Oh, this is kind of sad, isn't it? Like again, because like from the case we've had with him, like in the, the first case we had had with him, the reputation kind of like painted a view of him. But we see ourselves in the pre the other ones afterwards. Like he's not that bad, you know. He's got his own motivations, and indeed in his own in his own standalone games, those motivations are very much uh, pointed out tenfold. Is going to trigger anything? Possibly. Oh, look at the thing that's broken on it. <gasps> yes, there you go. So yeah, that's that's what was the that's what the deal is with this fucking trophy. Like, uh, there's a bit more to it than just the old, um, just a big ass K on the side of it. <laughs> yeah. It's so. the broken shield and sword. Yes. But again, the critical thing is the sword is gone now. It's just a broken shield. Okay. Mm. <laughs> That's good, isn't it? Nice, nice little touch, that. Yeah. yeah, I like that because you yeah. know, you know, I also know this story, but I think it is probably better told through this <laughs> medium. Yes. I mean, she did. She he did get us to tell the story anyway, you know, because we knew all this ourselves. Like, like we're very edu well educated. Back then, contradictions just meant something else, you know? It wasn't just, like, murders and stuff like that. It was merchants. That's what you had to nail down. <laughs> Capitalism. Exactly. <laughs> With capital K. <laughs> That's capitalism. <laughs> oh. 
<laughs> I didn't, because I already knew that story. Ha, <laughs> Emma. Yeah, idiot. He's a very, he's an old philosopher, he's an old philosopher, old Edward, isn't he? With his Chinese proverbs and his, his remarks to himself. Moping over so, the God. Gant got rid of the sword part. Yes, he did. Into yes. the back of Neil Marshall. Ooh, that's 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 Burkbar calling her shot, lads. Mark it down. Mark it down your uh, your bingo cards, lads. We're going for it. She's going for it. <laughs> My best evidence. Yes, that would be ideal. But no, we have what we need. And now just have to quick skip along to the criminal affairs and get uh. them. Hey, look who it is. Why is it wrapped in paper? I don't know. And it's not cooked either. <laughs> Why that. is it leaking? <laughs> you just took it straight from the butchers, you bitch. Put that back. about suckling a cow. Yeah, let's not go there. <laughs> I mean, look, I'm not, I'm not here to judge, but she's on several fucking different types of, uh, of, of watch lists. She does have a jelly-filled donut in her hat, and for yeah, that, I'm, I am jealous of her. I, I'm really, I'm, I'm upset that she's nicked her gimmick, to be honest. Yeah. That's, that's ridiculous. Like, like I get it. We haven't done the podcast in a while, but like, fucking, don't rub it in, you know. Okay, I'm gonna yeah. hear her side of it now. We are. Yeah, bear in mind, of course, um, we have not actually spoken to Angel Star about S Online itself. Yeah, she was on the investigation too. falsely mm. you know getting accused for your brother's murder yeah that'll do it yeah like that's the thing like you're actually gonna get, get obsessed and unsurprisingly star is uh, leaving all this on the door of uh, Lana Sky What do you think their tag team name was? Like I know we we've got their sitcom name, but they had they they must have had like a a catchy like what other detectives would have called them at the time. Demon Sky. Ooh, oh that's nice. I Sky like that. Sky Swimmers. Even though he was definitely the murder, the the killer, they stitched him up still, which meant like by doing that, like his trial would have been invalid. And better mind of course, again, like they have specified in this case in particular that for crimes like that, you are getting the death penalty, which means that like Joe Dark is now dead. Has he definitely been killed in the last few years? Yes. Right. That is that is expanded upon at some point. Like again, Ace Journey tried to like euphemize it a little bit, but like it is very much inferred that like he was sentenced to death and he was killed. <laughs> 